Hello everybody, welcome back to part 4 of Galaxy 2. Let's keep moving. Fluffy Bluff Galaxy, we just got the hidden star, now it's time to go back and get a regular star. Whew. Time for the Code Brigade Captain. Uh, one thing I, I failed to point out, you notice that the... That the crown was silver. There is different color. I think there's a gold crown. Yes. Uh, obviously, there's a comic crown. You know the comic stuff. Um, I'll have to get back to you on what the different colors mean. Honestly, I don't know. Yep, we definitely lose, lose it if we touch the cloud, which is not good, not good. Yeah. Well, I thought I could over here. Yes. Yes, we can make three clouds. So you remember with cloud, you do have that weird little floating jump thing that's going on with it. Fill our souls here. This is a good level if you want a bunch of coins. Bitch. Some crazy looking mo monkey grabbed the power star. Our captain chased up the wall by going off to the lights. Okay. All right, we'll, we'll, we'll go and figure out what the hell's going on with this monkey. I think this thing's going to tell you about wall jumping again. Yep. That's all this is, so... More cosmic clones. And there they are. That's okay, because all we're doing here is getting these, uh, uh, this is what I was thinking of with the gray. I don't know why I was thinking that the gray star is made. Star, um, launchers. These pieces do. Makes a hell of a lot more sense than whatever the hell I was thinking. But, Cosmic Clones, as long as you keep moving the Cosmic Clones, and you don't double back on yourself, Cosmic Clones are going to be an asshole. Another one? What do you gotta say? Yeah, press B, shoot, shoot, star bits. Shoot star bits, that make dizzy. Kick enemy, fly, enemy fly by. That's who does it. I'm not gonna do that because I, I don't. Well, Alright, yeah. It's an interesting ability, but not like a super useful ability. It is, it, is a, it is a good ability. Yeah. Having trouble with that one enemy that's giving you some hit, some some shit, you can always shoot a star bit at it. Yeah, I'm gonna knock you. Ah ha! Whoa. 
Yes, it is, Toad. Yes, it is. And don't you forget, it, you stupid Toad. We're being honest with each other here. Captain Toad. He is pretty damn useless. I mean, if we're being honest with each other, he's pretty useless. But he does get starched from time to time, so he's not completely useless, I guess. But now we got our new friend, this monkey fucker. Whoa, it's you. Good work getting up here. They call me the chimp. <laughs> Seems like you may be a worthy high climbing rival. Take the star. We'll talk later. All right, just give me a star. Well, good guy. You know what? I was talking shit about this monkey. I thought this monkey was going to be so bad. He just gives me a fucking star. He's a good dude. He's a good dude. I like this monkey. Uh, you will have races with him. Not a bad guy. He is a guy. But another star bites the dust. There's our comet medal. Make sure we get that. And some points. And we're back in here again because it's shut off the cloud in our room here. Look at that. I see you brought back some kind of a floaty souvenir. Yes, I did. It's a cloud flower. Wow, there sure are some weird stuff out there. Oh, yes, there is. Yes, there is. So, I'm surprised we don't have the fire flower. But, okay, that's cool. Whatever. Yeah. Oh, this is the thing I was talking about uh, a couple parts ago. That sent me over to the toad ship. And, uh, you could talk to these guys over here. There is a one up over here, and then you could, you could talk to them. They got some. They got some stuff to say, but. You know, nothing too crazy there. If you want a free one up, though, just go there and, uh,. And you get yourself a free one up. Riveting commentary, I know. <laughs> Alright, but now we are gonna keep going here. I don't think this. I think we got one more. We got. I'm pause real quick. Sorry for that weird cut there, everybody. Um, I wanted to check out that silver star because I was a little confused by it. There is a silver point, a silver crown, and a gold crown. The silver crown means that you can get that. That's getting all, all the gold stars that are available at the time. Whereas the gold one means is if you get all the green stars as well. But like fluffy buff, buff. There's no other stars to get. So, there's, I, I'm just a little, I guess, I guess I'm just a touch confused. Oh, Starless. Yeah, I think we're good. I think, I think we're good. Um, I don't worry about it. I, I think, I think these means you, you hit, but there is a comic coin here, so, so, oh. Either way, we're just, we're gonna keep moving on. That's all I know. As we head to the final level of World 1, which is Ballard Jr.'s Fiery Flotilla. But it's all good, folks. It's all good. Uh, Gubble Guts, Aching Belly. Oh, his aching... My aching stomach. Alright, another big level here. There's a comic coin right above that swamp there, so keep that in mind as we get up there. It's pretty fucking noticeable in the beginning of the stage if you're not paying attention to the hell you're doing. These guys you cannot kill by stepping on them. You have to spin into them. Then you can stomp on them if you want a coin. Or you can spin again to get star bits out of them. Whatever you want to do, but you do have to spin. I don't know why Mario just did that. But you do have to spin on them first to get. Or you can just knock them off the edge like that. So remember, on on this guy is the comet coin. 
what we want. Damn it. Oh, I almost died. That was way too close for comfort. Oh, some free coins there. You can definitely come over here. Dry those work the same way that they always do. Uh, you stop on or spin on them and they... Uh, they die. Or they don't die, but they, they fall apart and then they die. I already know how to do that. Another camera? Another dead camera. Or magic poop, but it's probably magic poop. It's not really camic, but I call them camics because why not? Come over here for your life stream to get six health again. That now is your max, unless you hit three again and then you revert to three. But now we are here. And a fairly, I said a long level, it's probably a little bit long. But if we do have another boss battle, Bowser Jr., he's... He's an asshole. Whoa, you made it this far, huh? I won't need my dad's help to finish you up. I got a big surprise for you. Oh, gobble -ga, dinner's on. Don't forget to pack your belly eight ball, just... Fucking moron. Just tells you exactly how to kill him. This weird dragon guy. Hey, it kind of reminds me of the dragon from Wonder. Kind of. So it's time to time to hurt him, and uh, there's some pretty fucking obvious spots. Oh, you're gonna need to hit. Oh. Ow. This level, this boss, it's a little chaotic. When he starts going through the ground, but like, just keep it wet spot. This is really like most, like most Mario games. It's not really difficult or anything. He thinks he or she was a star bit to get a coin out of it. Ow. Worth it. Yeah, just keep your wits by this 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 battle, if, if nothing else, is fairly chaotic. But you didn't have to destroy all those red giant, you know, hit things that you need to hit on his stomach or whatever, but and then he goes down and you kill him. He disappears, which is weird, but But you actually get a grand star. You get the <laughs> well I heard one one person call a child proof star. Which is just utterly fantastic to call it. I'm gonna go get some new targets out of that. Boom! And we got our first grand star. Grand stars! I, I think they just have you. They'll tell you here in a minute, but I think if memory serves, they just kind of send you back. They just allow you to go to the next world. There we go. Boom. Yep, it opens up a 
the, the next world. Ooh. And it does count as a star, by the way. More star bits, more coins. Wow, look at that, you did. You brought back a grand star. That's great. Now we can use the power of that grand star to travel to another world. Mm. Yes, we can. Yes, we are one step closer. I'm jiggling just thinking about it. Ready, Captain? Yeah. So here we go. We are headed off to a brand new world. World 2. We're awesome. And you're awesome. And don't you forget it. Wow, take a look at that. We found an entirely new world. No shit! Looks like there should be play a power star here. Go ahead. We're all counting on you, Captain. Damn straight you are. But now we're head here with us is the Puzzle Plank Galaxy. A puzzling picture block. Oh, pardon me. I yawned in the entirety of part two, and I'm yawning again. I didn't yawn last time. Yes. Oh, all right. Yeah. We could do hit some of this for some free stuff here. Hit. Yeah. Yeah. Really gonna take get use of uh, some ground pounding in this level. Go here, you can actually ground pound down, but we're not gonna do that yet. And ground pound this, got more star bits. This is, this is certainly some music that's in this game. It's an interesting, this is an interesting tune. Are right, you ground pound this and actually send this whole thing down? Ground pound to kill a wigger. You just step on him. Oh, we'll show you what happened there. Fucking wigglers in the way. Well, that sucked. That really sucked. Cause I got a feeling it's gonna send. I don't know what that that what that would gave you, but I thought it gave something good. Damn it! I got that stupid fucking wiggler in the way. Good news is. We are here. Alright, we got another one of these assholes. How many coins are you requiring? I know I don't have enough right now. 70! Well, I don't have enough right now. That's, that's gonna be my goal, probably. Oh, we'll go down here. Hmm. Well, maybe we know, maybe we'll have those seventy stars, seventy coins, right? We didn't quite get 70, but we got a good amount there, but we're still six short, which is a bit unfortunate. Ooh, oh, we're going we're gonna to have just that 70, folks. Just that 70. Like, literally just barely at 70. So, another hidden star, folks. 
Another hungry Luma that wants coins. Yeah, he's got big coin craving. It's less than the last guy, though. Other than that. That's tough. I'm so full. So you know what he's gonna do? Transform! He's gonna transform. Boom, new planet. Hidden star time. A new planet was born. Basically a giant fucking tree. The Deku tree! It lives again. Alright, here now you're gonna have to use your, your uh, clouds to make platforms. That's too crazy, honestly. That's not too crazy. But boss time! Secret boss time! You have to ground pound on his back, but now he's flying, so he has three phases. He does drop bombs though, which is a bit of a problem. Oh no! Okay, okay. Oh. Boom! That's our second hit. But now he gets angry, he turns red. And now it becomes a bit more difficult. Surprise, surprise, right? He likes to turn aside, and there is a way to hit him when he does that. That's really, really difficult. Fair, but that is our third and final hit. As we kill this weird mechanical bug-looking dude to get our power star. Boom. Power star, good. So when you're in different worlds, you notice the background when you're on the starship is a bit different, so that's pretty cool. I like I like that little touch. Bugaboo's back, yes, that's right. You thought you remember that from Galaxy 1? Yeah. I think it was in that one. But now two sets are open, two new worlds are brand open, and you can go either way because they both lead to the same spot. Obviously we're playing every level, so... Yes, oh, we gotta do a few new changes, what happened? Toe came back with you, right? He sure loves delivering mail. I am over here! I got some mail, fucker! Go ahead and humor him. Maybe he's got something for you. I remember that mail toad in the last game gave you... Gave you one-ups from Peach. I'll see what he has here. I started delivering mail and my first letter is for you. Hell yeah. How are you? I am very far away. Blah, 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 blah. Please attach the Peach. Blah, 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 blah. Same. Same thing. And she could a one up. She is so thoughtful. But the bitch gave us three last game, or five actually. And this game she only gives one. That's some bullshit. Alright, but this is the grand world map. So I'll show you a bit of a new map here. With the grand story, you can travel great distance across space and time. Now we can travel to another world whenever you're ready, Captain. Uh, I don't know when the um, I don't know when the comets come, but there is comets that come eventually. Um, I'll have to figure that out. We'll, we'll find out soon enough. But that's gonna do it for part uh, four here. Um, so join me next time as we continue through, and hopefully maybe get a comet soon. Until then, deuces.